seven, ten, nine. We have ignition sequence start. The engines are on. Four, three, two, one, zero. We have We have the clock is running. Hey there, shaving fans. Steve here. Welcome to another exciting episode of Watch This Guy Shave. <clears throat> Alright, so today is going to be an exciting shave. I shaved last night with uh, a single edge and I did a shave of the day. Cold River Soap Works and uh, Lemon Thayer's and uh, Mirasol Lemon Limon. Aqua de Limon. And I've been on a, since I was on vacation, I took a single edge razor with me on vacation. And I took my uh, Schick Injector razor and I took a DE razor. Shaved with all three on my vacation on the cruise ship because they wouldn't let me take a safety, I mean a, a straight razor on the boat. Evidently it's a weapon. I don't, whatever, fuck it. So anyway, um, I've been on a single edge kick lately. Like since, anyway. So on the boat, I just I decided to I take and shave with each razor, and the single edge, the single edge razor, the gem, gave me my best shave. I don't like DE razors at all anymore because this thing shaved so well, and I shaved with one yesterday, and it was the same thing. So I'm going to shave again today, and I've got a little bit of growth. Not much, but um, I'm just going to do like a with the grain and maybe slightly across and no against. And in that way, um, I won't get a whole lot of irritation. So that's what's going to happen today. Now, uh, I got some new single edge razors in the mail before I went on vacation and one while I was gone. And I haven't had a chance to, uh, to show them off yet. So here we go. This, I'm, I really am excited about having. Um, this is in a box, new in a box, new in a box, Jim Jr. And there's a price tag on it, and it says $39. But I think they meant 39 cents because that's what it says on the box, 39 cents. And so there it is in the box. Now this has got, if there's the box opened and it's got a fat Bakelite type handle. Now look at that. Shiny. It's got some patina on it, but no wear. I have already put a blade in there. Uh, but there it says Jim Jr. And um, here I'll just take the blade out. And there's there it is open. This thing's a beauty. And look at that handle. It is, it's a big old fat handle. I like having big fat things in my hand. So, big black fat things. So, there's the handle. Here's the blade. This is just a Jim Blue Star. Uh, I've already shaved with this blade. This is the, going to be my sixth shave with this blade. So, matter of fact, let me get it in there, right? Okay. There it is. Now, there we go with the blade in it, as you can see there. And, dig this. It came with the original instruction booklet. And it is in mint condition, folks. Hold the razor head flat against the face. It shows you how to shave your upper lip. It says use only genuine gem blades in this razor. So, sorry Ted Pellas fans, 
you're not allowed to use this razor. So anyway, there it is. Now, also included in the box is a box of brand new Jim Micromatic blades. And you open the box. Open the box to find three still in the wrapper Jim Micromatic single edge blades. Now ain't that just peachy? I thought so. So I've got myself a real Jim here. So anyway, there's I put the box over here, keep it from getting in wet and all that with the instruction booklet. And so now on with the shave. Uh, today shaverage is big black dick. And this is the white or the light rum. Dude, this shit is so smooth. You guys you never had any big black dick in your mouth, you don't know what you're missing. Salud. Freaking A. Alright. And now, I've been soaking this brush here. I ordered a new brush yesterday. I'm not going to tell you what it is until it comes in. I'm kind of excited about it. This is not it. This is my fine, fine accoutrements, 20 millimeter, finest, or bet is it this best, I no, I think it's the finest badger. It's a two band, or is it, uh, whatever, finest badger. It's not like silver tip, but it's close. So that's what we're gonna do. And I got soap in the mail from a buddy. He just sent it to me out of the blue. I really appreciate it. Um, this came from my, my good friend, Mr. Feather. So if you don't watch Mr. Feather's uh, shaving videos, look him up. He's a good dude. And uh, he sent me this. Shaving soap. Fat cock. I just sent him a text message and asked him when he wanted his fat cock back in his hands. He hasn't replied yet. But anyway, I digress. We're going to shave with this fat cock. And we're going to drink this big black dick. I've never used this soap. This is a, uh, I smell a little bit of menthol in there. I don't know if I get much else out of it really, but I've been kind of fighting off a cold. So, and I don't have the best nose in the world anyway. So, there we go. Let me load it some more. Cause if you don't load the shit out of it, You'll never get what you want out of it. I've discovered that lately too. This brush is a little wider than the uh, the actual soap tub. So it's, I probably should have spooned some out and put it in a bowl. But, oh damn. But that ain't happening now. So, all right. There we go. Rinse it out. And when I send it back to Big D, he'll, uh, excuse me, Mr. Feather. I don't think a lot of people actually know his real name, and he may want to keep it that way, so I'll just leave it there. So let me wet my face. And 
and I've got some of that soap out of the uh, tub from the So here we go. Getting a good lather out of it. Put some water on there. Looks like a glycerin soap. Probably melt and pour. Not that there's anything wrong with that. This is a nice lather. I really don't get any flavor out of it. No scent at all, really. And if there is any menthol in it, it's negligible. But I am getting a good lather out of it. There's some cushion there. Okay. Okay, so my big black handle, Jim Jr. Here we go. There's a little bit of slickness there. Not much. So.
All right. That's going to do. I'm, I'm not there. Shout out to uh, Ian over in the UK. Thanks for hanging out with me yesterday. We uh, we got on uh, Facebook and chatted back and forth and watched uh, football all day long. Watched the Euros. Uh, great game. The England match was uh, unfortunate, and the uh, the Wales match was a, was a nicely uh, contested game. I liked watching that. But I really enjoyed talking back and forth with you, and look forward to doing that again real soon. So, Ian, cheers. Have some dick. All right, that's gonna be my shave. Oh yeah, he told me to, uh, was, he told me to give you a real bollocking. Uh, you uh, unfriended me on Facebook. I don't know if you meant to, but Ian said for me to give you a bollocking. So, bollocks, or whatever. Go to hell, whatever. I don't know. Whatever that means. I'm not British. I don't understand the lingo. I just do it. <laughs> Alright, so, well, where's my space off there? Let's uh, go with the atom block just to see if I got any irritation. I don't think so. I just, you know, a little bit of. Yeah, nah, nothing there. A little bitty nick right there. No, no, that's just a blemish blood there. Thought I saw some blood. But, no. Sorry James, no blood today. Not always. Not anymore. I'm getting halfway decent at this shit. So, there we go. I'm gonna dry off my atom block. Put it back in the box. Rinse off my face with cold water. Any of you guys also watching the YouTube video, if you haven't seen Bald and Beardless, that's his channel. I think his name is Josh. Bald and Beardless. Look him up. That dude, he is one funny dude. You will not, uh, you will not go unhappy with watching his videos. I'm here to tell you right now. He is top notch. He's funny. He's creative. Uh, he's a little edgy, so if you're not a fan of of risque language, well then you're probably not a fan of my channel either. So, but there you go. That's what he is. He's he's funny as hell. He just throws it out there. It's great, it's great fun. I love his videos. So, drive off with the the Thayers. That was Thayers lemon. Oh hell, who's calling? one special just my wife <clears throat> all right uh, oh yeah aftershave for the day no I don't want to use that I want to use I want to use this I haven't used it in a minute brute the essence of man It's a very nice. All right, folks. Thanks for watching. Uh, hope you had a great weekend. Hope you have a wonderful work week ahead of you. And uh, bye, bye, bye to you all. Take care.